Hello. On the road to election 2010. On the road to election 2010. On the road to the elections. On the road to the elections. On the road to the elections 2010. So today I thought we could talk about some of the people who are up for election. Number one is David Cameron. Now, I wanted to vote for this dude for quite some time because I thought he was really cool. He rides a bike. He's quite young, fairly young. His wife is quite cool. She's the someone for either executive, like, um, she has a job at Smith Smithson. I can't even say the company. But yes, quite cool, isn't it, really? So I thought, what are the ups and the downs? the ups and the downs. As you may know, the country, that being the United Kingdom, we're basically in like a trillion hundred thousand pounds worth of debt, basically, which isn't good because it means that everything's expensive and people have to pay more taxes and all that shiz. The thing is, with David Cameron, his hair is always very pristine and neat. He sometimes looks as if he wears makeup. Now, <clears throat> And obviously his wife works in the fashion industry. So if we had that pair in power, are we just going to end up in more debt? I mean, I'm not going to lie, you know. It, it's probably going to be a danger if someone is given that amount of power. I mean, it might be amazing for the fashion industry, but, you know, what's good for the fashion industry isn't good for everything else basically imagine being in power okay so you wake up in the morning and you've got the entire country to look after I mean I hope they're looking after me to be honest and my well-being never mind yours and the next person's and the person who lives next door to you that's a lot of people if you think about it if everybody who watches this thinks that this is getting a little bit confusing and so there's a lot of people to look after basically and if the people who are in power are going around spending money on hair products and handbags rather than equipment for troops in Afghanistan because there is a lack of equipment I did a theatre project on this and it's horrific basically I don't want any of these people to be in power because I think I'd be better in power. I'm not going to lie, you know? And I know some of you, you think that. So maybe I should just leave school now and take take my place. So the whole hair gel, handbags thing with the camera might be an issue. But something which isn't an issue is his eco-friendliness. I am very down with the whole eco-friendly thing. David Cameron, get on your bike because that is cool. I don't care what anyone says. If I saw a famous person on a bike, I'd, be, I'd probably stop them and be like, high five me right now.